Hello there YouTube, welcome along to another movie review uh, and in this movie review video, oh I need to drop the DVD then, way hey. um, I am reviewing this, The Secret Life of Pets Oh my god, this has probably been the most, probably my most wanted film to watch in 2016 I saw the trailer to this last year I think in the cinemas and I instantly thought, yeah, that's definitely a film that I'm either going to watch in the cinema in 2016 or I'm going to buy it on DVD when it comes out in 2016. Um, so, yeah, anyway, I'll tell you what the film's about. Um, I'll tell you what, I'm going to start off with the beginning bit because the beginning bit we learn about Max, who is this character here. And, of course, he's very loyal to his owner, Katie, Um so, and they both love each other and all of that, you know. Both got a lovely, strong relationship with each other, you know, between dog and human, you know. Like, as they say, a dog is a man's best friend. Well, it can also be a woman's best friend as well. Um, so, anyway, yes, of course. So, so Max, um, well, first of all, Katie found Max on the street uh, in a cardboard box that said puppies for free. And he was the only puppy left, so, and instantly, um, absolutely loved him, um, just by the way he looked and all that as a puppy, and the way he just jumped up into her arms and all of that, so, um, yeah, which was really, really good. Um, and then after that, we then get to meet all the other animals, so there's cats, there's birds, there's, you know, there's all sorts, really, in this, um, in this film. And it's really fun. I'll tell you what, the beginning bit is really funny because, you know, it basically shows what the trailer showed last year, um, which is basically the beginning bit of the film. Um, so, of course, you've got Chloe the cat. Um, of course, her owner feeds her before he leaves the house and she doesn't want the cat food. She instead goes into the fridge and sees that there's a chicken there. And at first she's like, no, no. No, I don't want that chicken. Uh, but then ends up eating the chicken. Then she falls off the fridge, and then the next shelf she uh, the next shelf she finds is a cake. So there we are. Uh, so that was a really funny bit. And there was another funny bit as well, where a budgie uh, went out of its cage after uh, their owner left, and uh, basically turned the fan on. Turned the TV on with some pilot, uh, with some airplanes on the TV, and pretended that it was some sort of airplane or spacecraft or something like that on the TV, which again I found absolutely hilarious. Um, so yeah, in theory, there is a load of hilarious bits to this film, uh, really. And when you watch it, you kind of think, "Hmm, I wonder if my pet actually does that when I'm not at home." So it's really funny. Now, also as well, uh, it's not all about Max. It's not all about all these animals. It's also about Doug, which is this one here in the corner of the DVD case. Now, Doug is uh, another dog that Katie buys one day. And Max doesn't really like him at first. And he has to kind of get used to the fact that he has to have um, another another dog as company in the house. Um, but before before you know it, though... The good thing is, is that they both get along and it's after they get into some sort of trouble with the other pets uh, in the outside world, in the sewers, um, which is then when they start to form some sort of really strong uh, friendship between each other, which is really, really good. Um, so, yeah, it's a good film. I really recommend it. And also as well, not only that, right, it comes in this very cool case here. Um... But this is like a little unboxing. I've got the DVD in my uh, PlayStation 3 at the moment because I watched it last night. Uh, let me leave that there because that's my uh, DVD code. Where's that just gone? I'll leave that up there. Up there. Leave it up there. There we are. Uh, but also as well inside you get a sticker sheet as well, which is really, really cool. Uh, I'm not sure whereabouts I'm going to put those stickers quite yet. Um... But yeah, so there we are. Um, so there we are. I'm going to give you my review very quickly. My um, uh, my rating. There we are. Also as well, um, in the special features, which I normally don't go on about when it comes to like 
doing movie reviews, but for this film I will go on about it because in the special features you also get three mini movies. Now there's one called Norman TV, which is where a guinea pig uh, is looking around some houses, trying to uh, well basically he's going through the air vents uh, in some of the in the building where all these animals live, and they're there and he's basically there trying to watch what humans are up to. So it's basically his little TV that he's looking at, really. Um, so, which is why it's called NTV, Norman, Norman, Tele Norman Television. There we are. Trying to get my words out. There's another mini-movie called Weenie as well. Now, Weenie is basically, I think it's an American term for sausage, right? Um, but anyway, so there's a mini-movie about sausages and... And how it's okay to be scared, uh, and there's and there's also another uh, mini movie as well, which is about minions trying to get a blender but have to work for it for money by um, doing some old people's garden. So there we are. So all those and loads, loads more features are on this uh, DVD, which is why it's a definite watch. You know, um, I'm probably not going to be watching this now until Christmas Day. Because this Christmas I'm going to be watching loads and loads of DVDs. Um, so I probably won't be watching this now until Christmas Day. But I'll tell you something now. It is an amazing film. If you've not yet brought it, it's definitely a Christmas buy. Um, and it is a really, really, really funny film as well. So that's why I definitely recommend that you guys go out and get this film. Um, anyway, there we are. So that is the Secret Life of Pets uh, movie review. Uh, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. I'll bring you your next YouTube video tomorrow. Now, tomorrow's YouTube videos are two reviews once again. Uh, the two reviews that I am going to be doing tomorrow are Finding Dory. Yay! And also as well, Independence Day Resurgence as well. Because I've also recently got those films. And I'm hoping that tonight I can watch those films um, and then I can review them tomorrow. So there we are. Anyway, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Next YouTube video out tomorrow. But from me here, it's goodbye. And thank you very much indeed for watching this video.